You represent your generation, young people who have a greater ability to enact change than any before you. initiative gives us a great opportunity for our students to take what they're learning in their classroom, to take their life experiences, and in an innovative way create something bigger that then they can then launch as their own social innovation venture. My name is Haley Johnson. My name is Paul. My project is entitled Schooling and Self-Love, Busting Body Image Issues. And essentially what I'm doing is I'm making a short documentary um, concerning body image issues from young college age women. My project is called uh, Read Box Traveling Libraries. And what we do is we bring in books from people in the community and donate them to inner city schools. Step one, uh, selfie with Hillary Clinton. Uh, step two, uh, just sitting in um, on those information sessions with really prolific figures. I'm registered for a workshop, um, community service as a tool for education. So I'm really interested in that. So that's something that I think will apply to me as I go into teaching, but also apply to two different aspects of my project as well. My project being in the inner city is that I don't want to appear to like come in and be the savior and like the be all and end all of English education in the city, but to really reach out to them and build connections with them and like giving um, the teachers in the city a voice and giving the students in the city a voice as well and having us all be a part of it instead of me coming in telling them what I'm going to do. We talked a little bit about that in the office hours. I went to with Susan Davis, who's the founder of BRAC USA, um, and she talked about getting past that savior complex and this kind of relates to what America Ferreira said on her first night. Ask the questions. Learn about the real obstacles that stop people from getting to where you're sitting right now. Be grateful for the opportunities you've had and then go and work with those who don't have your opportunities to create the future you want to live in. I talked to a lot of students from a lot of different universities and their professors didn't even know that they were at CGIU and their college didn't support them at all. At Nazareth, they encourage you to do it and you have the opportunity to do it. So if you're at NAS, this is definitely something you should consider because the college will support you every step of the way. Students, particularly those who go to Nazareth College, should definitely reach out to the Center for Civic Engagement and apply. Today we were also interviewed by WXXI, um, we were on a radio show called Connections with Evan Dawson, so I'm hoping that that'll be um, a really nice platform for, you know, articulating what I need to do next. What we found is there are a lot of first-year students, freshmen, sophomores, that are applying and being accepted into the program. And so in many ways, the Clinton Global Initiative University defines their Nazareth experience because then when they come back, they can take classes and they can get signed up for experiences that really help them develop their project even fuller. So that was a great surprise to us uh, and it really has shown true. 